that the clubs have over your wives. So I, I, I appreciate it. Oh, that's not it's true. Okay, that's so not it's true. a miss. But, but no. here's the deal we pay this for is, our license here in San Diego. I, I understand. You pay, we pay for it to wrong. be independent. No, no, we, that's it's not, not wrong. It is not wrong. Because I pay? work, yeah, well, I I work at a club pay. that pays me, honey. Right. I work at a club. No, I have a choice. I know. I work at a Who are you? Let me. I, I, my name's Lorena. I'm going to walk away. I'm Jules. No, it's okay. J-E-W-E-L-S, Jules. But, but I'm an I independent just want to make contractor. sure this, this argument you. has been interesting because by law Ooh, this already, this my bill has nothing to do with, oh, that's my bill has nothing to do with uh, the state of, of your employment. It's already been determined. What? So I, I'm glad you guys are speaking up and I'd love to talk to you about why I think it's always better for workers to be, um, to be classified as employees. But the truth is, and I don't know if people realize that, the state of the law was determined not by me. I'm not the one determined you guys were, were supposed to be That's employees. That's not true what you're saying. The state of the law was determined to make differentiation between who is an independent contractor and okay. who is an employee. Right. Don't interrupt it, me. Uh, Do not interrupt me okay. while I'm speaking. I, I, I'd be happy. I just want to make sure you the understand. The classification of an employee does not fit how we do our uh, job as dancers. Our, the clubs do not provide us with the tools that we need. They do not tell us the schedule we need to work. We pay no, them I'm just sure. because they do marketing, they pay for overhead. There is a um, agreement. So there's no reason that we should have to become employees. Okay, so what I want to, though, I want you to understand is, you know, the deja vu lawsuit before that, um, uh, Spearmint Rhino, mm -hmm. is that the name yes. of the club? These lawsuits had already happened. If you guys want to protest the, the judges that determine that, that's not what my bill does. And so I don't want to speak on behalf of workers in any industry besides those which I, I'm part of, but we do have Alana who is also part of the industry and has a very different take on this. And so I think it's important to hear both sides of it because I think somebody has told you somehow my bill is going to change something. It's not. The law is set in the law, so there's nothing except for saying. That doesn't talk about the dancers in San Diego. The, what about our flexibility in hours? Okay, do you know that that is completely up to your employer? What so has the, the employer can ask you what hours you want and give you those hours. The law doesn't say you can't have flexible hours. That's that's up to the employer. It says that we should be paid minimum wage for no. our. No, yes, it, it, it says you cannot be paid status. less than minimum wage. It doesn't say you should be paid minimum wage. If your employer is paying you minimum wage, that I, I by all means, that's why we have unions. That's why we have collective bargaining. You should take that up, and we will help you take that up with your employer. The law does not no, say that. No, they're not saying anything like that. We have fair conditions. We have good pay. We have a decent place to work. What this happens when you get absurd. hurt? What happens when you fall off the pole or That's what I one of the paintings? Yes. Yeah, but actually the club is the supposed club. to cover you as an employee. It's called workers' compensation. But I'm not I have a employee. girlfriend who, because I was employee. you, yeah, you, you are. What's your name? My name is Alana Evans. I am, I am the president of the Adult Performer Actors Guild. I represent porn stars. And we have been working for the last few years because this doesn't just affect you. It affects us too, That's and on my, no, it's job. but it's not, but it's not because I started my job as a house dancer. That's I worked different. as a dancer. I'm, I'm speaking. You didn't want to be interrupted. It's my turn. I worked for three years as a house dancer. It feeds into the industry. We're not you know, have a set schedule. You know, you, you, hours, work. We're not you know that if you go to the club and you're late for that time that you tell your job what time you're going to be there, they find you. You know this is real. So things that you're arguing that are going to change are being in place right now. And you're being fed, you're being fed misinformation. What you deserve is protection. And what you also deserve is when you're at 40 years old. I was able to take care of that surgery because I worked I mean, uh, work all very hard as a dancer. If you're a yes, treated as an employee, it come out of Since 19 office. years old, born and raised in San Diego. Woo! Third Woo! generation. Woo! Oklahoma. Yeah. We came from Oklahoma. 
So we're doing pretty, pretty good. And this will I'm affect my hours. This, my boss is telling me you need to be down there because see, that's, that's what the you would be here for. The message comes down from the people that don't want to pay the employee taxes. They don't want to pay workers' comp. They don't want to pay into Social Security so when you're 60 plus years old or you get hurt and you need disability, none of those things exist for us as workers if we're not recognized as employees. And whether it's on your feet and in your heels or on your back, I have the right just as much as you do to be protected. I dance to put diapers on my kids just like you did. And you deserve we are independent protected. contractors as dancers. We're not, we're, we're not poor stars, honey. Like, you're a poor star. star. And I'm I not have been treated we're as an independent contractor okay. this okay. whole we're time. Okay. The, the whole point is, the I, there, there, there are a couple things, though, I want to be clear. We've classified as the same, and that's where you ladies are not understanding. This affects all of us. You guys have sex. Nobody on. Okay, okay, wait, wait. We dance. Alright, so alright, alright. There's no okay. difference. The rest but, but, of the world is not the same. That's you it. Guys, you're shaming. If we can not work, my choice, my choice, my choice. Right after she shames you for the My choice, my choice, my choice. If anyone is interested in understanding how you can empower yourself as an employee, because that's a state of the law now. I'm sorry, and I'm sorry your, your employer told you to come down here. That's fine. But somebody might want to, so we'll give you information. He said, if I went down and it would help the outcome, possibly. Of course I'm going to participate if I've already done 15 years in the industry. i got another 10 years in me yeah. energy. I hope your boss is paying you for being here because when a boss tells Actually, a worker to no. go do something, that's usually what happens. Um, so, I know, I, I, I totally get it. Hopefully that's Trump will it. stand up for us and okay. actually do it. Okay, okay. Hopefully Trump, Trump will finally take it. That's why we're here. That's clear. Don't be that's our future. That's why we're here. Not